people are paying more attention. Paying more attention tonight to new water restrictions about to go into effect in Cape Coral. As of Friday, if you live in the Cape, you can only water your lawn once a week during an assigned time period. Four in your corners, Lisa Greenberg riding along with code enforcement officers tonight to see how they're cracking down on this order. She's live at City Hall in Cape Coral with more. Lisa? Well, Patrick and Amy, what's interesting about this is the code compliance officer I spoke with actually tells me since this water restriction took effect on Friday, they've actually seen fewer violations. But as you're about to see, it's not all about cracking down on the code. If you run these too often or at the wrong time, you could get a visit from this guy. Hello. I'm Chris Conrad. Chris Conrad works for Cape Coral Code Compliance. He looks for people violating the once a week watering restrictions. The first violation is a warning and they get a flyer. It goes in the little bag and we have a little flag that goes up next to it. Like the people living at this home. Sprinklers on means snapshots of the home, a notice at the door and a note in the system. He says he's seen about 50 first time offenses since Friday. A number of second violations and three or four third violations. He's also spending time. I'm doing something else. Most of my day has been setting timers, something I started uh, over a year ago on my own. He takes house calls to help people reset their timers. With the new uh, water emergency, they're going to be starting at 4 o'clock. They have a 12 here. My dad was wondering why the sprinklers would come out at, like, at nighttime when he didn't want them to come out. And if there's a problem, you call me. Oh, okay. And I'll come back and I'll set it up for you. A few minutes away, Conrad sent to the home of some seasonal residents. Okay, let's take a look. Their next door neighbors happy to see the help. We've got a limited supply and everybody needs to uh, chip in and do their part. To keep you safe from flames like these. It's dangerous and it's been windy too and that doesn't help the fires. 